Hi, right, so um, here's my dodgy generator board. Um, on the back of it, I can't really move this around a great deal, uh, but on the back it's marked um, whether positive and negative in each of the frequency takeoffs. Uh, I've already wired up um, a crocodile clip onto the positive, which is a power supply. We will follow that lead back up. Oop, I've just turned that to the positive on a normal guitar stomp box battery. Um, apart from that, there's a negative coming off, which I've taken down to oh, beep um, the shield of a guitar which is connected to a guitar amplifier, and the signal lead I've connected to a white lead with a crocodile clip on either end. So what we'll do now is um, we'll take the uh, obviously there's two black leads coming off here so there's a shield off the guitar lead and then a second one which is the other part of the power supply so what we'll do now is we'll plug that on to uh, oh, just flipping out might help if we get the camera in the right place um, we'll plug that on to this tag here which is the negative excuse my video skills <laughs> oh, I'll try that again right so now we'll take the white end of the guitar lead oh, it's somewhere around here uh, and what we'll get is, if we listen carefully, this, well, let's get it right, uh, this first tag is the highest frequency. Well, you can hear that. Then the next one is that frequency divided by two. Um, an event just popped up. <laughs> so, so you can hear that's half the frequency. And then the third one along is that, again, divided by two, so the next octave down. And then another tag down, say so it's pretty flaky because I'm trying to do this with all the cable still in place. And then that's that one, and then we'll go again, and you'll hear it divide by two again. And then finally the last one, which is the lowest note. Now, if you notice, there's one here that's uh, not coming out right, so we've got the highest, then it drops by an octave, and then then it drops by an octave again, and then you'll see that that fourth tag and that third tag are exactly the same note. So what we've got here is we've got a dodgy divider running between the third and fourth. And this is what I was saying in the email, that the, the one afterwards is still a lower pitch. So that means that the divider there is fine. So that's the divider fault, that's how you find your divider fault. And it can be done with just a battery and a guitar lead. So I hope this helps anyway. Alright, cheers mate.